4th of July. This is official Franco Fishing Channel. Yo, guys, um, I was not expecting to do a, a little video today. I was doing one the day before yesterday, but sadly my phone has died out on me. But I will post some pictures of some catches that I was going to do a video on. I caught my first ever snake hit. But before I give you guys details, um, happy 4th of July, guys. I mean, hope you guys have a blessful day with your family and friends. Be safe out there. Safety is first, like I always tell my friends and everybody. Um, yeah, so uh, today we're going to do an official Creek Series uh, vid today. I'm here at Rock Creek Park, as you can see in front of me, guys. It's a beautiful day today. I mean, today I was not expecting to come fish. I'm exhausted from work last night at 1030. I had to go straight to New York and then I had to come back. Uh, in midday today and I had no rest at all but I'm feeling pretty excited today even though I'm kind of tired exhausted I haven't had no sleep but as you can see today guys this is a beautiful creek this is where I caught a snakehead uh, I'll be putting details in the description below and the setup I already got this uh, I think it's called the slingshot Zep Zepco Zepco rod uh, I just got it from Walmart today um, we're gonna try it out and see if we can catch some biggins I just saw a huge carp here guys today and I brought some bed, some bed, some bread today. Uh, I brought some white bread and some hot dogs. So we'll see if we can catch how many species we can catch. We're also going to be using some lures. I brought some Zanko, um, Zankos, uh, some crankbaits and see what we can catch guys. So stay tuned. This should be a nice day today. Hopefully we can catch some good. Also, I'm gonna mention, guys. Uh, I have my phone with me today because I was bringing my GoPro. Was planning on using my GoPro for the first time, but my brother used it and he forgot to charge it, and I was kind of upset. But hey, we gotta improvise. So I'm using my phone today. So bear with me, guys, with the quality, the audio. I'm gonna try my best to give you guys some good shots, and I'm gonna be posting some pictures in the video too, in case I don't. Because I'm by myself today. My brother sadly was not here today, so he went out with his friends. So. So we can see we can make the best out of it today, guys. So stay tuned. Should be fun. Yo, what's up, guys? Uh, I actually caught me my second first ever largemouth bass on a pink Senko. Uh, I wasn't recording it good enough, but I'll put a picture on it. Um, wow, I, like, I just saw it like right in front of me. I just put, put down the pink Senko, and it just hammered it, man. That was awesome feeling. It was a good, chunky, decent size of bass. I'm going to put a short clip of it because I accidentally bad released it, but it's okay if it swam off, so I'll put the picture on in this little small Yo, clip. Yo, guys, I just caught me a largemouth bass on my pink Cinco. I don't know where it flew off at, but look at this guy. He's a chunky, chunky little guy. Wow, he's a gorgeous fish. Hey, guys, uh, what's up? We caught ourselves a second fish of the day, a little beautiful, up nourished. Mount Norished catfish. It's a good size. Beautiful little guys. So let's go release them, guys. It's a decent little catfish for this river, man. Alright, guys, we're gonna go ahead and release this guy. They can let go. Let go, little dude. Off she goes. God, I love it, guys. Got a couple of minutes left, so we'll see what else we can get, guys. I just noticed that I just noticed it's like a school of carp here and there's one that is about a 25 pounder with some small ones there but yo I just threw some bread right now hopefully I'll be able to catch it I'll be so awesome if I can catch one and I'm gonna go if I haven't catch anything in a couple of minutes because I'm uh, almost out of time 
I'm gonna use a little a frog lure that actually looks like a frog. Um, let's see if we can catch something with it. Uh, it looks pretty cool, so, but I'm gonna try it out if I can find it. Uh, oh, here it is. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. So, we'll see if we can catch something with it. So, stay tuned, guys. Guys, I don't know if you can see, but look, there's a carp right there. Oh, that's like a 15 pounder right there. Uh, there he goes. Wow. I remember what Jeremy Wade used to say they are river monsters. I also see a school of sunfish there. I think they're green, green sunfish, and there's some bluegill mixed in there, but there's a pack of them. Guys, do you have a favorite spot where you like to fish at? Let me know in the comments below. This is awesome. Even though we didn't get that many fish today, but hey, a little chunky. Yo, guys, time's up. I couldn't catch anything. I tried. I was almost got a, I got a few bites, but it was just a lot of these sunfish trying to steal the bait. But hey, two is better than nothing. I tried to catch some carp out of here. There were some snakeheads, but I guess they didn't want to bite anything today. But hey, we got a green, we got a largemouth bass and a channel catfish, better than nothing, right? But yeah, guys, I want to thank you all so much for this time, you know, to show you guys my new spot here in Rock Creek in Washington, D.C. I hope you guys have a safe and happy 4th of July with your family and friends. Stay safe out there, guys. God bless. Keep, keep fishing, guys. And venture out there. Go look at some new spots. Fish it. You never know. It could be a good surprise. God bless, guys.